power overrated? No, it's not overrated if you can do it. But what happens is too many players that don't have power try to hit one or two home runs. And I'm telling you right now, if you're not hitting double digits, don't hit any. Know what type of player that you are. Like my brother played six years of pro ball, great athlete, left-handed hitter, had this much power to hit six to eight home runs. What happened is that his, the dreaded batting average suffered because he was trying to hit bombs, right? Everybody's like, oh, they're spraying the batting average a trap. Oh, oh, guess what? I'm trying to help you hit your, ha your highest batting average by getting the right guy playing every single day and competing with confidence, right? But if you have some power, bro, drive it. If you can't drive it, don't swing. I had 6,000 at-bats in the minor leagues. 0-0-1-0-2-1-3-1, I was trying to hit a bomb. You know what happened then? My singles got harder. Why? Because I was in a more aggressive mindset. If I'm just trying to slap singles around, I ain't hitting for no power. If you're playing third base, first base, corner outfielder, bro, you better hit some bombs, right? How do you hit a bomb? For me, you hunt a speed, you attack the inside part of a pitch you're looking for. If I'm sitting on the fastball, I'm going to look for the high fastball because it's going to be easier for you to stay tall on your backside and attack that pitch and, and your, your back shoulder is going to collapse. You want to stay away from the early collapse, but it's going to be easier for you to attack that and adjust to the knee-high strike than it will be to look knee-high and then he's going to elevate you and now you're going to be underneath the ball. Mark Trumbull, who I've been talking to for you know, two days a week for the last eight years, I told him that. He's like, really, you're holding that one back after seven years? Buddy, attack the fastball, man. Hunt the fastball until it's time not to. Once it's time not to, runners in scoring position, I've already smoked his fastball, right? I guarantee you, out of Trumbo's 200 and something home runs, half of them are on off-speed pitches that are strikes. See, a breaking ball is a hittable pitch if it's a strike, right? For me, a breaking ball, if I'm sitting on a breaking ball and I'm going to try and hit a bomb, because you could hit a bomb on a break ball if it's a strike. I'm going to look for it up and in, thinking right center. Right? If I try to pull that ball, I'm going to ground out nine times out of ten. But the key is to take a controlled, violent swing on a speed that you're looking for until you get two strikes. With two strikes, I'm battling. I'm not trying to hit a bomb with two strikes. I might hit some, but I just have the good approach and, and thinking right center and, and, and you know, just hitting the ball hard. But my bombs are coming from count leverage and... and give me a little bit of controlled violence because that's what hitting is man it's controlled violence it's not violent violence not control control it's a controlled violent act to hit a baseball and if i got a little bit of power well i'm trying to drive it if i don't have power why would i want to hit uh, a bunch of fly balls to try and hit one home run i want you to be a line drive machine i want you to get great at lining out right good hitters line out more Right? Be a good hitter, then the power plays. If you, the, better, the better hitter you are, the more your power is going to play. Right? But trust me, it is not overrated, bro. We get paid th from driving balls. Right? Home run hitters get paid. Right? Doesn't mean you get big, doesn't mean you try and hit it far. Keep hitting the ball hard.